this is part of the course from above the bridge, down below the bridge, the state park. Let's see. 68? 68, well, it seems warm, but let's go check it out up the river. She's excited. <laughs> it was a pretty windy day. You can see that it doesn't affect the currents, but the wind kind of makes the experience a little more uh, hectic. So before Jan got in the water, I got in and made sure I knew where the eddy was, where it began and where it ended, and how the currents so were moving. So she was less than 80 degrees for the first time. <laughs> so we're just going to spend some time floating around. Stay here. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> and like I say, the idea is just to get used to it, float around and look underwater, those kinds of things, nothing big. And again, it's 65 degrees up here, a little cooler than downriver, so she's complaining a little bit. <laughs> so she worked for about 20 minutes or so, 15 or 20 minutes before we shot this video again. You can see the improvement in the next scene. Good beginning today. We were just going to, going to have her put her face in the water and get used to that. Um, she forgot her nose plugs, nose clips, but did a great job without them. It was a big adjustment. Um, so it's a great beginning. Try and get down to the river and see if we can have her swim part of the river, getting used to the currents, how they move her, and her orientation in relation with the bank a little bit more. Um, in this next clip, she's trying to work on using her side vision but she looks to the side and see the bank and get used to swimming straight but good beginning really good